Yellowstone is no stranger to providing as authentic as possible insight into the world of cowboying and ranching on John Dodden's, played by Kevin Costner, ranch. While John's ongoing rivalries have kept the drama alive within the storyline, fans have also grown familiar with seeing the likes of Rip, Cole Hauser, and the rest of the bunkhouse get their hands dirty when it comes to tending to the cattle or other cowboy duties. Creator Taylor Sheridan is adamant that each actor attends a cowboy camp ahead of filming each year to get the cast up to speed with how exactly life on a ranch works. This includes the rearing of cattle, branding, herding and all kinds of other jobs a real-life cowboy would have to do. All of these activities have been depicted in Season 5, with the latest episode even showing environmentalist Summer Higgins, Piper Barabo, helping the likes of Ryan, Ian Bowen, and Teeter, Jen Landon, administer medicine to prevent the spread of brucellosis among the herd. However, there have been a few instances in Season 5 so far that appear to have irked some viewers. One particular scene which garnered a lot of negative attention is when Mo, Mo Brings Plenty, and Thomas Rainwater, Gil Birmingham, attend a media gathering on the reservation. Left completely in the dark about the president's imminent arrival, the pair were stunned by heavily armed security personnel callously and brutally manning a closed-off area. They showed no mercy as they began shooting and killing innocent dogs which were wandering harmlessly on the land, with one agent insisting they'd been instructed to kill any strays. Mo was understandably furious at the savage and callous reaction and fans at home also felt the scene was particularly hard to watch. But now, Lloyd star for E.J. Smith, a man who has been part of the Yellowstone cast since the beginning has defended the depictions seen on screen when it comes to animals. On Instagram, he posted a clip explaining and defending the show, although sadly his audio couldn't be heard. He did clarify his stance in the accompanying caption, however, writing, not one horse or animal has been harmed or put down on Yellowstone TV. Taylor Sheridan is very conscientious about the animals we use in our scenes. He followed this up with a series of hashtags including hashtag American Hatco hashtag Gow Itha Coopers hashtag Justin Boots hashtag Yellowstone TV hashtag Rasinkor Anch Mercantile hashtag Frontier Rodeo Coffee hashtag Okandedan Whiskey. It didn't take long for Foray's Instagram followers to show their support for the actor after he'd taken the time out to defend the series. Instagram user at Jaws underscore factor append, of course no animals are harmed. Never even gave it a thought but anything that gets you to post, I'm all for it, happy holidays. While at Shalene and Chucks agreed, this is like a PSA. I like this video a lot. Taking such good care of the animals. At Cara Maria Beast Mode still shared their concern, I know that. It just still hurts my heart. I love horses and all animals WTH my whole heart, I have to turn away and cover my ears. While at Shannon Corkins seemed relieved, I'm so happy to hear that. And at Froggy Holer Farm echoed, keep on keeping on. There will always be someone that can't stand the way you do things. All I gotta say is screw em. Keep being the good old boy we know you are. People are going to hate no matter how hard you try. Keep trying to open folks eyes. If they can't see it, they need to put their noses back in the corner. Sick, Yellowstone returns to Paramount Network in the USA on Sunday January 1st and Monday January 2nd on Paramount Plus in the UK.